Que onda vatos? Thanks again for tuning in to yet another video of Infamous coming at you live from the West Coast. Yet again, we're looking at some more leaked images from Harley Davidson. Somehow Harley accidentally leaked this on their website. Now they took it down, so now you can't see it. But now you can see it right here. Uh, this is the uh, 2022 117 Lowrider S. So luckily, we are getting a base model. This is what they called it on their website. This is the 20... 22 lowrider s 117 base model so i'm guessing on the 26 we're, we are going to see that touring package that i've been mentioning and like i said earlier in another video it's a 117 and as you can see it has that uh that uh, heavy breather of course the 117 uh air filter that uh, they that they offer on the cvos uh other notable changes as you can see right up here we no longer have a um a, uh, a dash with gauges now they cleaned it up and now they have this uh, it looks like the black line I can't get a better angle at this but it looks like the black line dash it's a company in uh, in Italy I believe somewhere overseas that makes these dash these dashboards uh, more of a low profile so if you're out there and you're and you're thinking about switching it up I was on I was honestly thinking about switching it up with the black line but I didn't want to take that risk of getting it shipped over and then you know uh, paying all that money and then potentially have it damaged on the way over here so now we have this uh, it looks like it has that wrinkled black finish on it i wanted it more of a of a high gloss smooth out uh, finish to it but of course you could sand that down and if we look up here on top of the handlebars as you can see we see some uh, some gauges i don't know if there's if it's a dual gauge setup or if it's a uh, more of a digital i don't know like i said i i can't get a better angle of of the bike so then that's pretty much it um you know what i don't know if these are confirmed or if these are real they look legit uh, i believe they are we also have the uh, the gunship gray i'll be posting it uh, on the video as well looks just like this one and i don't know like i said it's not a big uh change of horsepower or anything like that so you guys just go ahead and share your thoughts down below do you guys like this new dash you know what there's people out there that are not a huge fan of the uh, of the gadgets and and the dashboard on on the tank it's a little bulky it's a little bit too big so this is a good alternative you'll be able to buy this straight from harley davidson now of course now that they're producing it you won't have to buy a third party one or the or or you won't have to order one um uh, online overseas so you don't have to take that risk of getting it shipped and then pay you know hundreds and hundreds of dollars and and potentially get that damaged uh in transit so i don't know like i said you guys go ahead and leave your comments down below let me know what you guys think are you guys looking forward to this 117 i already have another video i break down all the power and all the specs and everything so now we're going to be waiting on the 26th which we should see the uh the the <clears throat> the fx lrst the touring one and we should see the cvos we already saw a few a few models already I already released that video uh, i believe on the 26th we're going to see cvos we're going to see the lowrider st and then we're i'm hoping <laughs> what i'm hoping for is the 975 iron or something along those lines something with the with the uh, revolution max so anyways you guys just stay out there stay safe don't believe everything you read life's a risk get out there and ride later